Sometimes during my PhD, I can struggle uh, to operate some uh, instrumentation tools. There are other PhD students that struggle uh, too. <laughs> And we overcome uh, the struggle and we work together and it works. It feels so great. It is uh, enriching for all of us because uh, we share knowledge and uh, how to use them uh, best. <laughs> Hello, my name is Ancelin Salerno. I'm currently doing a PhD at CA Litty. I'm in second year now. And before that, I was doing the engineering school, which is called FELMA at Grenoble. First, I chose to make my uh, last engineering uh, internship at CLT, and then during the last month that followed, I decided myself to do a PhD here because the subject was great, the atmosphere was cool, and I like uh, my uh, colleagues, so that's why I stayed, but at the beginning I was not totally sure about doing a PhD. The subject of my PhD is called Hyperdimensional Computing, which is a new machine learning algorithm. We want to evaluate it against other machine learning algorithms in both accuracies or time and energy consumptions. And we will test it on gesture recognition using surface electrodes, for example, on the forearms. And then we will make live demonstrator using an electronic card. And at the end of the PhD, the goal is to make a new kind of uh, computer that can perform in-memory computing and we want to use that kind of chip to perform the algorithm. The first impact of my research is that the new machine learning algorithm can reduce energy consumption for embedded device, for example, for people with prosthetic to use it longer. And the second application is for non-embedded device, but for a new computer architecture that can perform in-memory computing. It could lead to huge time and both energy savings. Maybe the day that uh, my uh, PhD supervisor uh, congratulated me because I have uh, some uh, new uh, results that uh, were better than some uh, state-of-the-art uh, paper. And also the day when I won a prize for a best outstanding presentation, I think it was the title. I would like to work in a research and development uh, environment with both hardware and software implementation because I like the idea of optimization and time and energy uh, savings. <laughs>